What's up? It's Truly. Welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited for today's video, not only because it's my birthday, but also because we're doing some really fun hairstyles. I have a bunch of different accessories for us to play around with today and try new things, but first I'm gonna show you guys how I did these butterfly buns. I did the cutest graphic little butterfly liner to match with the hairstyle. I feel like it's super on brand. I also just love butterflies. I have two butterfly tattoos. This one is actually an anime character's wings. It's Pooh from Hunter Hunter. I also have another little butterfly from Hunter Hunter. If you guys watch Hunter Hunter, let me know in the comment section below. It's my favorite anime of all time and I always love to chat anime. That is super off topic. Let's get into the tutorial. So to start off the butterfly buns, you're just gonna wanna take a few twists. Depending on the size of your twists or braids, you may need more or less than what I'm grabbing. I grab about four per side. I take it and I just bend it into a, like a little bubble like that. And then I just secure it with a big fat elastic. <laughs> Just like this. The way my twists line up on the other side, I'm actually only grabbing three. And I'm just repeating the exact same step. You're gonna wanna make sure these are both as even as you could possibly get them. That's good enough. Then you're just gonna take the front twist from each bun and you're gonna pin it down with a bobby pin. Just like this. This just creates the cutest little butterfly wing look. And honestly, you don't even have to add the clips if you don't want to, but I just do because I'm a little bit extra. <laughs> Now it's time to decorate with these little butterfly clips. I cannot remember where I got these, but I think I got them off AliExpress or Amazon. I'm gonna try to find them online for you guys and I'll leave the link in the description box below. I am literally just placing these butterflies at random. The beauty of this hairstyle is the clips don't have to go in certain places. And just like that, our butterfly buns are done. These are so cute guys, you have to try them. The next hairstyle I'm gonna show you guys is probably the easiest out of all of them. Is it the easiest? You know, it might be the easiest. Literally all you need is a cute little hair clip. You don't have to have this same flower one that I have, but if you want it, it's from Princess Polly. And it matches my shirt. I actually bought them to go together because I thought it would be like the cutest thing ever. And I think I'm right. So for this hairstyle, you can either leave two strands in front or you can pin them all back. I love to leave two strands out. Then you're just gonna take the first two strands at the front. If you have smaller twists or braids, you might have a lot more at the front. So in that case, just bring back anything at the front. Once you bring them to the back, you're literally just gonna take your clip, open it up, and clip it down. And ta-da, here's summer hairstyle number two. For our next hairstyle, we'll be using this super cute hot pink clip. It literally looks like it belongs on a freaking doll. For this hairstyle, you're gonna be leaving out the front three pieces, and then I'm just gonna take the rest of the hair, not all of it, I'm gonna leave down a few of the strands, and I'm gonna tie that into a high ponytail. Takes a little bit of elbow grease to Grief. Takes a little bit of elbow grease to do it. Now you're just gonna flip this strand over to one side. So we have this little side swoop going. And I'm just gonna take this fun little hair clip and pin it right up here. This just makes it look more fun. I'm a Barbie girl in a Barbie world. And this is our third hairstyle. This next hairstyle requires no elastics, just headbands. You can either use a regular style headband or you can use something more fancy. I'm gonna show you how to do it with both. You're just gonna wanna put your headband on. This never looks that cute. <laughs> and then wrestle your hair to go through the headband. Now on Instagram, I always see girls wearing their headbands like this. Let me show you. I always see them wearing it really close to their hairline, actually pretty much covering their hairline. I've always wanted to look like a baddie with it, but I've just never been the baddie with the headband. And I wanna be. Honestly guys, I'm giving bench warmer. This is not a flattering look for me. So what I like to do is I like to pull the headband up, either wear it further back like this, or I like to pull some strands through. This way I have the headband on, but I'm not giving bench warmer, I'm giving clueless. I'm giving cutie pie. <laughs> and if you wanna jazz it up, you can use a fancier headband. I feel like the fancier the hair accessory, the more it looks like you put effort into your hair. So I'm just over here collecting fancy hair accessories. <laughs> I basically do the same thing for my fancy headbands. Oh my gosh, you guys, I forgot that someone drew me. And ever since then, I've been really self-conscious of my hairline. Let me get the picture. I cannot believe that someone drew me looking like this. That's me. 
if you couldn't already tell. They drew my sister so cute and then they made me look like Megamind. But even Megamind looks better than me. Anyways, this is the last hairstyle. I am so happy that I finally convinced myself to get twists. I was scared for so long for no reason and I'm so glad I finally did it. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and I hope that you gained some inspo from some of the hairstyles I showed you today. I also really want you guys to let me know which hairstyle from today's video was your absolute favorite. Please let me know in the comment section below what type of videos you want to see from me next. Since I'll be posting this video on August 7th, which is my birthday, that would make me a Leo. Did you guys expect me to be a Leo? Are you shocked that I'm a Leo? Anyways, I will see you guys in next week's video. If you guys want to keep up to date with me all the time, you can follow my other socials. That will be in the description box below. I also post shorts on here daily. And yeah, I don't know if I already said this, but I love you. And I hope you have an amazing day. Okay, bye.